This is Metro Mix Party, and it's happening. We're here at the Metro Mix launch party in Los Angeles, downtown at Crash Mansion, a new venue that has just opened up. Later on, Squeaky Clean and Diplo will be hitting the decks. And we'll be talking to some of the hosts of this evening, including LA Taste maker Clint Catalyst. I am one of the hosts, Clint Catalyst. Hello. Hi. Really loud. I'm sweaty. I heard maybe three words she said, but two of them were my name. Well, you're a tastemaker in LA, correct? I've been quoted as such, but not by me. <laughs> I can say it. You may not be able to, but That's I can. That's right. This is Jared Gold. I'm hosting his part, his fashion show oh, on the 14th. Oh, I want to as well. Because he's obviously, he designed this, right? Designed this jacket and his furry arms. <laughs> Jared Gold, thanks for um, talking with us. Hi, Blaze. Let me see your fabulous sleeves. Now, how many stuffed animals died for this? A lot of little stuffed bears had to die. For this. There's bear. no way I could be with him if it were real fur. I just did a PETA campaign. I know. Right? But there's children somewhere that don't have their teddy bear anymore, right? I'm not really concerned about that. Jared, you have a show in Fash LA Fashion Week. Tell us about it. The last night. We are closing LA Fashion Week, March 14th. Tickets are free to the public. Go to blackchandelier.com and you can just get one. It's a Union Station. It's going to be so beautiful. I can't wait to see it. The entire train station. That's amazing. Close. So we're putting it on Amtrak's front page because it's an historical event. 190 foot long runway and hardcore glamour. Sledgehammer. I can't top that. He, you know what? You just you just do all the presenting. We're here in the VIP lounge at Crash Mansion with LA Taste Maker, Frankie Chan from iHeart Comics. Frankie, what do you think it takes to be an LA taste maker? I actually think I think that it's pretty easy in LA. All you have to do is just have your own thoughts and you can be an LA taste maker. Well, a lot of people have their own thoughts and their own style, but some people don't have good ones. Yeah, well that's a problem. And a lot of times people may have their own thoughts, but they're really too shy or too worried to express them. I think if you could come to LA and you're gonna have the like courage to like say say what you think or like do something that you think is cool that maybe no one's doing. If you were like a comic superhero, which one would you be and why? I'll say the most common answer honestly is Spider-Man or it's because he's an average Joe with a very common problem. He can't pay his bills. He can't he can't get a girlfriend. Radioactive spider. Yeah, well that's you know he has an, he has an extraordinary thing in his life. I can see myself in him because I'm lucky enough to be able to have this extraordinary thing like IR Comics, which is like which is like happened very much as on like luck and just like hard work. But like I live in Los Angeles, I don't have a car, I can't afford a car. Like I just got my first bed six months ago I've ever had in my whole life. Uh, you know, it's like, so we're building, we're putting everything into the idea.